The Wailing. Wow, this movie. Oh my god. I just... What? I got so into this. It was two and a half hours and I was like glued to the screen. I was like, oh, this is happening. And it was so good. And I'm just completely confused. I have no idea what happened. Like, if someone out there has seen it and understands the story, please comment with like a spoiler tag and tell me what it is because I've been on IMDb message boards like, what the fuck just happened? And no one knows really. The comments were all just mumbo jumbo and uh it was amazing i loved it oh my god it was um it's about this tiny village that um is sort of in chaos right now people are just murdering each other for no reason and um basically what happens is someone kills another person and then they go fucking crazy and, uh, you know, they get, like, all these sores around their body, and, uh, eventually they, like, become, like, solid and die, and, oh my god, it was brutal to watch. It was so many brutal scenes, and I loved it, and it was so beautifully shot. It's shot, I don't know where they shot this, it's, it's probably, like, a real village. It was beautiful to look at, like, the forest and the mountains and everything. Gorgeous colors, everything was, like, blue, a shade of blue amazing to look at. I loved it. I loved it. loved it. And the story is about this regular cop who, um, his daughter gets sick. His daughter starts showing the same symptoms that other people showed before they fucking went crazy. And uh, now he's really trying to investigate what's up with this thing, you know, what what's going on. And he's convinced that this Japanese man that lives on the mountain is um, convinced, uh, is uh, involved in it um and he's not really sure how or why but he goes to see him and blah 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 and things just escalate and uh it was really good it was really good and it was fucking creepy i wouldn't classify this as a horror movie it's more of like a mystery type thing but um there was one scene towards the beginning it's like right at the beginning where I was like, what the fuck, am I gonna be afraid? Am I gonna be scared? It was nighttime when I was watching, I was like, I'm home alone, my parents aren't here for like two weeks, I'm like, shit, am I gonna have nightmares after this? And, um, it was fucking creepy. It's like, when you see, like, monsters can be scary. It's actually scary if you don't see them in a movie. Ghosts never bothered me in movies, but people bother me. People can be terrifying. Um, if there's like a creepy person coming towards you in a movie, like I freak out. And um, that's exactly what this is. Uh, there was one scene towards the beginning where someone's in the woods doing shady shit and he was like, he was on all fours and he was like crawling around and I was like, no, no, I did not sign up for this. I, did, I didn't, I didn't want this. Oh my god so creepy and uh that scene alone it's like a very short scene where someone sees another person in the woods and there's like a moment of tension of like is this gonna be a jump scare what's gonna happen that was scarier than any like horror movie that i've seen recently like what the fuck that was terrifying um there was one scene that i was like okay what the fuck and um it, it's towards the towards the end I guess um it got pretty silly it got way over the top and it got pretty ridiculous if you've seen the movie I think you know what I'm talking about it reminded me of that scene in It Follows that everyone knows that scene in It Follows where everything just goes downhill from there it's like an hour into the movie where it's just like uh what the fuck am I watching it, it reminded me of that, but this movie was so good that I was able to move past it. It it didn't affect me afterwards, um, but it was pretty ridiculous as it was happening. I was like, okay, we're like crossing a limit here. We are about to do something that's not okay. We're about to like turn this movie into something that I don't want it to be. It's way too silly. It's what's happening. So yeah, I just... Like, I don't want to spoil anything, 
that's as far as I'm gonna go into the story. It's you know the girl shows symptoms, he starts investigating. That's it. I'm not even gonna say anything else. But I didn't know. I was following the story. I was fucking there. I was glued to the screen. I was in it. I was really in it. Like I had to go pee a couple of times, and I paused it. Usually I just go pee and I let the movie run. <laughs> this time I fucking paused it. Um, I was like, I'm not missing anything. It was so good, but at the end, I was just like, what? It had that limbo effect, and now Inside, if anyone's played Inside, oh my god, what was that? Um, Inside is like limbo plus plus. So it had that effect on me, but to the max, I was like, I, I'm pretty sure I followed the story. I'm pretty sure I was aware of what was happening, and then... I don't know, am I just overthinking it, the ending, and I'm just confusing myself? There's things that don't fit, and I'm like, is it just not important, or am I overthinking it? Just because someone does something at the end, I was like, what? A certain character does something, and I'm like, what? So, I have no idea, I, it, it was confusing as fuck. Um, I think the director meant it that way. Good for him. I, I, maybe I'm just too stupid to follow the story. Um, man, I was really into it. I was really into it. And, uh, I was really enjoying it. And I just, I'm thinking about it. Like, I'm thinking about the story today. And I'm like, I think that's what might have happened. It was just all over the place at the end, like, what whatever i loved it that's all that matters who cares about the story it's about the experience right like who cares about the ending it's about the experience i i never remember endings in movies in or in books really like books that i love 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 i don't remember how they end movies that i love 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 i don't remember how they end i remember what i felt as i was reading or as i was watching i remember the atmosphere i guess um I don't know, maybe I remember this one though. I, I think I remember this ending. Yeah, the wailing. It was totally worth it. Oh my god. I go in it uh not know anything. That's that's the best without trailers or anything. That's the best. Um I have no idea if the trailers spoil anything or not. Um Man, the wailing it was just so good, so good. That's it. That's all I have to say. So good. You're so many bad out, Mario. Mushin, you got in the way of you. Was it? Jack, who told me that I'm too good at the world? Who could not bring you one in the world? Sack, talk, young boy, you want to sing. 일이 다 나가래. 여기서 다 죽여버려. 직접 본 거야? 한번 봤지. 왔는가? 이 뭐가 이제 이거 뭐야 이거? 나왔다. 자네 며칠 전에 만나면 안 되는 것을 만난 적 있지? 아내가 그곳을 건드려 버렸어. 똑같아 증상이. 사람들이야. 아무도 안 잡히니까 아무도 안 잡히니까. 